The success rate of rehabilitation programs can vary widely, depending on several factors, including the type of addiction, the individual's commitment to recovery, and the quality of the treatment program. It's important to note that recovery from addiction is a complex and ongoing process, and success should not be solely measured by a one-size-fits-all metric. Here, we'll provide an overview of the factors that influence rehab success rates. Type of addiction. The success rate of rehab can vary based on the specific substance or behavior being addressed. Some addictions, such as alcohol or opioid dependence, may have lower success rates, while others, like nicotine or certain behavioral addictions, may have higher success rates. Individual factors. Personal motivation and commitment play a significant role in the success of rehabilitation. People who are highly motivated and actively participate in their recovery process are more likely to achieve long-term sobriety. Treatment approach. Different rehab programs use various treatment modalities, such as cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, medication-assisted treatment, MAT, and holistic approaches. The success rate can be influenced by the appropriateness of the chosen treatment for the individual's needs. Duration and intensity. Longer and more intensive treatment programs often yield better outcomes. Some individuals may require extended stays in inpatient rehab or ongoing outpatient therapy to achieve lasting recovery. Support system. A strong support system, including family, friends, and support groups like Alcoholics Anonymous, AA, or Narcotics Anonymous, NA, can significantly impact the success of rehab. Relapse prevention. Learning relapse prevention strategies and coping skills is crucial for maintaining sobriety. Rehab programs that emphasize these aspects can improve long-term success rates. Co-occurring disorders. Addressing any co-occurring mental health disorders is essential as untreated conditions can hinder recovery efforts. Aftercare. Continuing care after rehab, such as follow-up therapy, support groups, and regular check-ins with healthcare professionals, can help individuals stay on track and reduce the risk of relapse. Environment. Returning to a supportive and drug-free environment can enhance the chances of success, while environments with triggers for substance use can increase the risk of relapse. In summary, there is no one-size-fits-all answer to the success rate of rehab, as it depends on a combination of individual factors, the nature of the addiction, the quality of treatment, and ongoing support. Recovery is a lifelong journey, and success should be measured in terms of improved quality of life and long-term sobriety rather than a simple numerical percentage. It's important for individuals seeking rehabilitation to carefully consider their needs, seek professional guidance, and actively participate in their recovery process. Does someone you love suffer from drug addiction? Don't wait until it's too late. Call our 24-7 helpline at 1-800-570-2259. A caring addiction specialist is awaiting your call.